Damari, uh, Sonny was just in here and said on that pass down the middle, he just said he didn't even see you. He didn't see you coming. Tell us what you saw on that play and how you made that interception. Um, I just seen the throw on the back side. And um, I knew he was going to take a shot, so I just wanted to go out there and make a play, try to do the best I could. And I came down with it, but I didn't stay on my feet. I was trying to <laughs> take it to the crib, but it didn't happen. Steph, usually for offensive players, they will have an idea that they may score. But for a defensive player, you don't get the chance. So talk about the play and just what you were seeing as you were heading down the field toward the end zone. Uh, on the play, when it, uh, when it happened, it was uh, Alan George made a great play, uh, somehow getting the ball out, whether he used his hand or, or just hit right on the ball. And then uh, when I just seen the ball on the ground, all I was thinking was, hey, I can, I can make a play, scoop and score. And then just saw all these blue jerseys running with me. So I kind of just <laughs> got in front of them, and they just, uh, they just blocked. And it's a great feeling just to be able to have an opportunity to make a play for your team, especially that critical. We're down first drive of the third quarter. So just being able to make a play, it feels good. For either one of you, oh, hi. Um, <laughs> everyone has talked about how you guys have kind of been playing with the chip on your shoulder this year, and the defense has been able to come up with big stops and big turnovers. What has that meant for you guys? I mean, it's just a. Uh we just try to, we're trying to write our own script. Last year's defense is last year's defense. They're not going to make or not make a play for us this year. So we're just all out there trying to, trying to earn everyone's respect. So that's why we're just, we just got a chip on our shoulder and just out there trying to, trying to make plays to, to help our team win. And uh, we've been fortunate to, to get all these turnovers right now. And uh, it's exciting. Uh, just going off of what Steph said, I think it's important for us to go out there and make a statement because last year uh, we didn't do a very good job of playing any defense. So. You know, we're coming out this year and starting to call some turnovers, and we're playing, you know, like we know what we're doing out there. So it's, uh, it's good. Turn on the left corner. Sonny said that the, the biggest thing and maybe the toughest thing in a program is to get you guys to believe. And, and as you mentioned, I mean, last year obviously wasn't on defense particularly was a problem. What's changed? Why do, why do you believe more this year than you did last year? Uh, I would say it's just uh, being the second year in the system. In Coach Kaufman's system, we uh, we understand it better. We know what we're doing out there. We know the checks to certain formations. We know the terminology. So we're out there doing less thinking and more just being able to react, being able to play, think about what the offense is going to do instead of, oh, how do we line up to this or what is this? So it's just really just uh, being more familiar with Coach Kaufman. He's more familiar with the guys on this team. We we understand his philosophy and what he wants us to do and what he expects out of us on on certain calls. So that's allowing us to play a lot lot faster and a lot better. When you had that sack and you were open right in the middle of the line? Um, it was just a, uh, a little zero max blitz, and uh, our coach always gets on us like, "You gotta blitz your back, you gotta blitz your back." So always telling us what we gotta do, and we haven't uh, haven't ran it too good this year. But uh, that one, I just uh, we were in the call, and all I was thinking was, "All right, I'm, if my back steps up to to block, I'm just going." So that's what happened. The hole opened up, and I was just like, "Man, I just better not miss him because I'll never hear the end of it." So went in there, and luckily, I don't think he saw me coming. Damari, you obviously were not here last year. You went through a, an ordeal a year before. Can you tell us what it's been like to be back and how, how you feel about how you're playing? And just did you expect to make these kinds of contributions? Um, you know, I'm just really excited to be back and just be back with the program. We're doing great right now. And, you know, we got a little momentum going. And I'm just trying to do whatever I can do to help the team. So, you know, if I can keep making plays, I'll keep doing it. I'm just happy I'm here. Demari, how much did it mean for you to come back here? Because you're out, you're back here without a scholarship. You you wanted to come and finish what you started. How much did it mean to come back here? Um, you know, the biggest thing for me is I told my mom before I left to go to Cal was I was going to get my degree from here. So, you know, I had to come back and finish what I started, and you know, I just wanted to be back. This was my dream school. Steph, can you talk about what having Demari back has meant and, and sort of what his contributions have been? Uh, it means it means a lot because he, uh, you guys see how he flies around. He's he's real physical, so I feel like I kind of look at him as kind of the the tone setter. He gets out there, he's a uh, he'll he'll hit anybody, hit anything. So it, I'd love to see him just out there flying around and really and he just comes down there reckless and will just will just hit anybody. So it means a lot to just have him back, that physical presence, and he's a he's a great guy, one of my good close friends, and I remember. 
I was here when he was a, when he was a young buck on his first camp with uh, with Coach P when he had to lose some weight oh, and uh, <laughs> yeah, boy days, huh? yeah his a little chubby days but uh, yeah no it's just it's great to see him see him doing well and just watch him really grow up so it's exciting to have him back out here. Great, thanks a lot, guys. Yeah, thank you.